Okay guys, let's go for another tutorial. Uh, welcome to this channel. This is a channel full of NeoVim tutorials and you're gonna learn a lot of cool stuff about configuring NeoVim. For example, just like VS Code because there are a lot of VS Code fans but also NeoVim fans. So I'm gonna prepare the workspace and you can skip right to the tutorial. Let's begin. Yeah, I'm just printing an image in terminal. This is so cool. Check this out, guys. Check this out. I just say EMG thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, this is so cool. Okay. Okay guys, this is the configuration for going back and forth in files, in Vim script. Um, next it's gonna be navigation.lua. You know guys that I make uh, tutorials for Vim script and Lua too. And I'm gonna explain them. But I don't have the function. Let's write it now. Function map. Function. Vim API and Vim set key map. Normal mode. How about mode? Mode key command. Yes. Mode key command. Yes. And of course, we forgot about no remap function. And no remap options. And silent because I don't like being loud. That's it, mode key, command. Or can I do this? Local map function equals function. Okay, so. Um, yeah. Change this. Uh, wait a second. I have multi-cursor. Am I that stupid? Map mode. Okay. Wait, what? You know, guys, that with Control O you can run a command in set mode. And go back to insert mode without leaving insert mode. Actually, you're not going back, you're just staying in insert mode and running a command. Okay, I have to change this. Okay. Where, where I'm flying? Wait a second. Just map. Parentheses. Mode. 
these uh, quotes are broken, man. Okay. Let's go with this one too. Okay. Let's change this to insert. And we're done with navigation, with uh, going back and forth. How about control home and control end? And yes, I have a VS Code instance like uh, just here to show you some stuff. But um, you can see because of this. Okay. So. Um, when using VS Code, you can go to this file and press Alt-Left to go back, or Alt-Right to go forward. Uh, by default in VS Code, and this is a very cool feature. In uh, Vim, you, as you can see, you have uh, Ctrl-O and Ctrl-I, and you just have to remap these keys these functions, commands, whatever they are, to alt-right or alt-left, based on your case. Okay, navigation. Good. Let's test this. Oops, mistake. Okay, I have, uh, but I don't know how to test this. I must go back and press Alt Left. Yes, I'm. I went back, as you can see. Um, I'm here, and I want to get up. And I want to get back where I was before. Go up again. Go back. Okay, so it's working for um, for Vim script. It's working. But let's test now for Lua. Wait, what? Now we have. Uh, we went back. We went. We went at the end of the file. Alt left uh, took me back. Alt right took me forward. So it's working. Now, guys, uh, this is the part where I explain stuff. So after jumping um, over the preparation of the video. Um, you just went well here. So, let's start with uh, navigation.vim. Uh, no, uh, and no remap, you just no remap in a normal mode. Um, Alt left, Control O is the function where you can go back in Neo, in uh, Neo Vim or Vim by default. As you can see, I'm pressing Control O. I'm going back. Uh, control I is the same. As you can see, I went uh, forward uh, into that file. And uh, yes, uh, for uh, I know remap, we use Control O and Control O to run a command. We use Control O to run a command in insert mode, and we actually are running Control O the command for going back in NeoVim by default. And uh, the same here, the, uh, yeah, same here. Uh, Alt-right, Control-I, by default in NeoVim, and in insert mode, with no remap, means that you don't recursively, recursively map the, uh, the command. If you do that, it's going to be a mess, so trust me. Control O, Control I, and that's it for Vim script. Okay, Lua configuration. Uh, you remember the old function that I used in the other videos with map using the Vim API. And Vim set key map, mode key, command, no remap, true, silent, true. Okay, so we are mapping... Um, out left to control all just like here but in Lua configuration this is the same and we're done for this part with 
going back and forward. Now, let's um, let's use Control Home and Control N. In VS Code, as you can see, here is my cursor. Control Home goes up at the beginning of the file. Control N is going at the end of the file. By default, in um, Vim, you don't have this. Or yes, you have this. Okay, I don't have to make a tutorial anymore for this. Oh, uh, okay, okay, that's it. Um, other movements for VS Code? I don't think so. I just presented you in the other videos with selection. Go back forward. Go to definition. Yeah, go to definition is a more complex one. You need the um, language server for this. NeoVim. Or just a basic, simple, go to definition standard of Vim, which is not really what you want when when you you are developing a project. This is this just goes to the definition of the word in text, so it's not useful. I guess that's it for the navigation video. If there is something else, just hit me up with an idea. Uh, more videos are more videos are gonna come guys so sorry for my stupid English accent and uh, mistakes I'm just a learner like you and subscribe and support me on my great YouTube NeoVim channel on the internet world yeah bye guys